As we celebrate Black History Month, we salute local entrepreneurs who are making a huge difference in the community. Today, we got a chance to sit down with the owner of Atlantucky, one of the few African-American owned breweries in the nation. 11 Alive's Latasha Givens is there for us now live in Castleberry Hill. That's right. Good evening, Faith and Jennifer. We're live right outside of Atlantucky, one hour before its Black History program. Now, get this. They've only been in business for one year, but the owners have been supporting several local programs as well as mentoring others who want to work in the beer industry. From creating beats to crafting beer. Skinny DeVille says his background in the music industry as part of the legendary hip hop group Nappy Roots helped him prepare for this new venture. This is pretty much our, our brew house. Atlantucky just celebrated one year in business as part of the less than 1% of African American owned breweries in the United States. Its business model fuses black history and the highest standards for modern day customer service. George Washington Carver thinking with Chick-fil-A service. <laughs> um, you know, so we try to give you great service and we try to be innovative with the beers that we make and how we make them. But building a new business wasn't easy. When Nappy Roots tour dates were canceled during the pandemic, DeVille and his bandmate and business partner Fish Scales decided to focus on becoming masters at brewing beer, a process started by women in Africa around the 11th century. But craft beer is something that started in ancient Mesopotamia and Egypt. And uh, we lost that during the, uh, the transatlantic slave trade. DeVille says funding and financing are two of the hardest hurdles for African-American entrepreneurs. If you don't have that, it's very hard to get started. He credits Monday night another Atlanta brewery with helping them get started by simply sharing some of its equipment. He says that's why it's important for Atlantucky to give back to. Information and knowledge is, is, is king and you should pass that along as best you can. And as an entrepreneur, you should open up those resources that you have or created to people that might need that as well. And that's why proceeds from some of their beers go directly to supporting local efforts. Cheers. Cheers. Thank and you. Congratulations. In yes, honor of Black History and in honor of Black History Month, they are releasing a new L today called Brown Skin Lady and that celebration begins right here at 6. Back to you.